So we have new costumes that have been introduced in the Legends Summons portal. Hell has a costume. Wizard, the original version, is now a cleric. That makes things a little more tougher. But I think the stats are almost the same. Okay. So, Dark Legendary, Hell. One of the early heroes of the month. So from the 2017 family, the family bonus is one, two, three heroes, five, 10, 15 mana generation. So that speeds up things. Going into the stats, these stats are the old stats, but so compared to today, they are relatively old. Sorry, they're relatively less low, but okay. I mean, let's go into the hero special crush of malice that's the costume it used to be crush of hell and it was indeed a crush of hell in those early times <laughs> obviously later on there were more crazier ones that came so the costume does uh, 300 damage to all enemies the second portion is cast or steals generated mana of all enemies over four turns starting low increasing that script seems familiar the hit three on a tail this one does it to all and also hits harder. <laughs> all the tell is, has got a low attack and a high defense. So that's the difference. And um, in case, in case hell dies, then that effect gets cleaned up. Deals extra damage against holy and elemental link gives all dark allies plus 15 attack and plus 15 defense for six turns. This cannot be dispelled, so obviously I think Element links can't be dispelled. Deals extra damage against Holy, so I think that's about 15 to 20 percent extra damage, maybe 25 percent extra damage, so above that 300. So this makes her absolutely crazy. Very good costume special. Um, the balancing sits in the stats to an extent, which will obviously be taken care of by emblems and uh, limit breakers. So it's plain Jane straight hit all hero from an impact three earlier. She goes into an impact two. There she used to freeze mana like Proteus does. Um, here she basically steals mana. So that also in a way does not allow the heroes to charge up faster because basically the whole team gets messed up. Wow. She's gonna be chased or being already chased since 24 hours. The second fellow is Perseus, the ice fellow. Wasn't used much because he was a hit one. Now he becomes impact three. I like to use the word impact three instead of hit three because there's a lot more that the hero is creating as an impact. So that's that. Um, Perseus also belongs to the same uh, 2017 family. So there's the benefit. He is fast speed, ice legendary. Going into the stats, 725, 698, 1367. I think they are the same, okay. And uh, what do I say? Arctic wound. It used to be everlasting wound. <laughs> okay. Deals 305 damage to the target nearby enemies, which is nice. The target nearby enemies get minus 100 degrees of any healing received for four turns. So basically, they cannot be healed. And this effect cannot be cleansed also. So basically screwed. Um, the only thing that can save the ass of these fellows if it is Gazelle. But if Gazelle has been whacked, then there is serious problem there. <laughs> so <laughs> the target and nearby enemies get uh, minus 68 defense against ice. And that's where the impact of this fellow comes on Titans and of course events like hell would be used everywhere because of the high hit all percentage. Okay, minus 68 is high because I think the highest I remember is minus 56. So this is higher, maybe there might be somebody in between also. But elemental impact is I think the highest minus 68. And of course elemental gives 
plus 10% mana generation to all ice allies for four turns. You know the good part? If there are two 2017 uh, family heroes, then this element link becomes available to everybody. So apart from this, 10% more basically <laughs> turns heroes into much faster because these would stack. So uh, Perseus suddenly becomes uh, very relevant now. I mean, come to think of it, I mean, really impactful, you know, in uh, because I do remember uh, Ice Fellows get used in events and Perseus will be one of the big fellows being used constantly because of this heavy minus 68 uh, defense against Ice, which is clear 12% higher than what Frida gives. So that's that. Wow, congrats for getting both or even one of them and good luck in getting them. I did uh, a few, did not get anything. So AJ dropped in and since I was on the move yesterday, so I had no, not recorded anything, but there was nothing great to show also. So that's that. Um, yeah, that's, those are the two heroes. We've already discussed this earlier. Uh, let's see, the costume which got nerfed you know, the portion of mana reduction that she gives she used to be 20%, which has been nerfed to 10%. She still is useful, but at that minus 20, she used to be even more painful. So that's that. So these are the three featured. Trust this hero analysis helps. And let me know. What do you think? Cheers.